After a visit to Cheska High School, Brainerd High School principal Andrea Rusk was interested in a closet that provides, provided students with food and hygiene resources. Rusk then decided she wanted to bring the idea back to Brainerd. On this week's Golden Apple, our Chelsea Brown takes a look inside the recently installed Warrior Warehouse. Tucked inside room A110 inside Brainerd High School is the newly added Warrior Warehouse. It's like walking into a small grocery store. I like it. Among food items, hygiene products, and clothing items were all donated to support the needs among their peers. We also have a really strong recognition that our school community here um, is in need and, and we wanted to be able to help foster and support that need in any way we can. And about 42% of Brainerd High School students are on free and reduced lunch. One Brainerd senior shared her personal story of how a place like the Warrior Warehouse could have helped her when she was in need. Three or four years ago, um, addiction ran pretty rampant in my family, kind of just not good situation and food was never really on the table, never had dinner made for us, ramen noodles <laughs> every night kind of thing, like ramen noodles and peanut butter jelly sandwiches. Part of this effort among these high schoolers is to eliminate the stigma that goes along with those needing help. It's obvious that we have a need, but that need is sort of behind closed doors because not a lot of people talk about it. It's not something you bring up at the lunch table. People don't like to talk about it and it needs to be talked about and things like this need to come into play because kids just don't have their needs met. Our job as, as student leaders in the, in the building and community leaders is to help facilitate greater change and a greater understanding within our student community here. To support financial costs, the warehouse has expanded their efforts through 5th Street Brew Coffee provided for students in the morning. Because all the kids, if you walk around the hallways in Braided High School, 25% of people have a coffee cup in their hand. So why shouldn't that coffee cup come from here? And the fact that it benefits the Warrior Warehouse is what's super great. They also plan to foster a partnership with Second Harvest to continue supplying food needs. But first and foremost, they hope to be an outlet to help others help care for their families. Don't be ashamed. Like, come in here, get some food, get some clothes, get some shampoo and conditioner. Like, bring it home for your family and be a positive influence on them. On this week's Golden Apple, Chelsea Brown, Lakeland News. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.